Hello, this is Richard Wilson. I've been learning more about uh, sailing recently while running my business, and I've got a quick analogy I wanted to share with you about getting your business seaworthy before you really invest in advertising and get it to take off. So I thought here in Nice, France, right by the boatyard and all the yachts down here, it'd be a great place to shoot this type of a video and this type of content. So join me and I'll share uh, the story real quick in just one second. Great, now I'm down at the marina here in Nice, France. And the analogy I wanted to share with you is something I've been learning while learning how to sail, and that is getting uh, sea ready, ocean ready, or sea worthy, and getting your boat ready to go out in the ocean. If you're in the bay, you know, in a tiny bay like this, or one a little bit larger, you can go back across in the water with just your engine, or adjust your sails if you're good enough, or your sails can be kind of ragged, or inside the cabin, things can be thrown everywhere, and it's fine, because, you know, you're not gonna have much of a, a wake or big swells in the bay. Um, but they talk about in sailing getting your boat ocean ready uh, or seaworthy because once you go out in the ocean, you know, help isn't so close by. People can't tell when your motor dies. You can't wave people over when you're 10 miles out in the sea. And if your engine dies, your sails better be in pretty damn good shape. And inside of your cabin, when you're going over big swells, you don't want stuff flying all over inside the boat. You know, your metal um, compass might fly off and get inside of the head and stuff like that. So you don't want that happening obviously when you're sailing out in the ocean. Same thing with your business. If you go out into uh, the world and start really pumping a ton of advertising and marketing into your business, really grow your revenues and potentially your profits, and you're not really sea ready, um, then you can go out of business, you know, your boat could sink, you can really cause a bunch of trouble, a bunch of damage to your business, to your reputation, and just to how your customers uh, work with you. Whereas if you first get your business in shape and you have all your sales funnels in place, you have good, efficient customer service, all of your processes and procedures are written out for your entire business, if your employees are well trained, if your business is scalable, and you know that if you had five times your customers coming in, you'd still be profitable, still be able to serve them, give them a lot of value, give them great service, then you're ocean ready. Once you know that you can scale your business three to five times the size it is now, that is when you can really take your business out in the ocean and make it a lot bigger. This is something I've been going through in my business. We're looking at potentially taking out full page advertisements which in, within very large business magazines and industry magazines and newsletters, which might cost 10 or 20 or $30,000 for one advertisement. And the truth is if your business isn't ready for that type of flow and that type of attention, then it can destroy your business or do a lot of damage to it at least. So I hope this analogy of getting your business kind of seat ready is helpful. If you're in a position where you're trying to take your business to the next level from 100,000 to a million or from a million to 10 million, this is something I think you should really review and look at how you can make your business higher quality in all areas before pumping a ton of advertising and marketing into your business and taking it out into a you know rocky ocean or an area or environment that's really going to test how your business is ran. So I hope you enjoyed this video. It's Richard Wilson coming to you from East France, and we'll see you again soon.